What? Where's the boat? What the f They fucked us! What? Who? It was Vernon. They were waiting for us and jumped us. They were armed and just... Fuck! Did they have Clementine? No, definitely not. She's not with you? She's with someone else. Her parents were in Savannah, and I think someone used that against her. Well, we're going after her, right? Yeah, of course. Wait, what the hell happened to you? Cut it off. Seriously? I was bitten. What? It was an accident. Small, stupid thing. But yeah. Oh my god. Before we split up? Yes. You fucker! God, we would have gone with you! I lived <sighs> through it, which is a start. And, well, uh, I thought it might save my life. I was lucky to get bit down on the wrist, far from anything important. But who knows? Oh, God. Everything just... Uh... Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Get over it! Krista's right. Uh, boat yeah. was a pipe dream. We still go after Clem. And then we get out of Savannah and rethink our entire plan. Rethink? How about we just think for once? That's what I'm saying we do. Calm down, Kenny. Yeah, chill. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? Uh... Find a small town. Maybe one that hasn't been ripped up too bad. At some point, people are gonna have to start rebuilding. And you guys and Clem should be part of that. I don't know. Gotta have hope. We all do. Even you. Quit talking like you're already dead. Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill? Bandits? Hey, chill. Here's some pills. Vernon, chill! Here's our fucking boat! This isn't my fault. I can't point to one thing that's happened that isn't somehow your fault! Lee should have left you in Crawford. Fuck you, Kenny! Ooh. Careful, guys! No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katja and Duck. I am! And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead. No! You know how they died. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive or dead or walkers or worse and I don't know. So give me a fucking break! Oh, Ben. I'm... Thanks. Thanks for the screaming, kid. Oh, shit! Here they come! In the house! They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista! Get on the windows in the front room. Check the boards. Got it. Kenny! Look for weapons. Gather anything you can find. Will do. Ben. Go upstairs. And do what? Just go. Omi. What is it? What? Everyone, help Omi now! Shit. <laughs> Fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! Nice. Take their 
goddamn arms off! Now what? Shh. Everybody. We have to hide, and then find a way out. Lee's right. This place is secure. We're patient, and then we get going. Oh, shit. Fuck! New plan! Get upstairs! Go! Oh, that is she! Fuck. Guys, help me with this! I can climb to uh, faster than that. No, you don't need it. And we're safe. Did that? You did it the first time, man. Here, um, I'm not good with these. You dropped it down there. <sighs> that could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee still bitten. Shut up. Okay. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent III. Industrial... Need? Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. I'm sorry. So, no uh, ideas then. There's got to be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. <coughs> hey, you're not looking great, and you're warm. Uh. I'm okay. Don't. Oh shit. I'm okay. I'm really Paris. No. What did that mean? She's at the hotel where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Like I said, everyone needs to keep looking for a way out, damn it. We're trapped in here. Do you think that worked? I don't know. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. Uh... He looks fine to me. We don't need to talk about it. I think we do. I said we don't. 
Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. My arm is not the issue. I'm not the problem. The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem. Yeah, maybe at the moment, but who's to say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. Then kill me, you son of a bitch, okay? Don't even fucking hesitate! I will! Thanks. Ah! You ruined that dude's face. Shut up, sweetie. Yeah. Look. Shut up. It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. I'll be dang. This wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. I'm sorry. Me too. I get her. Go sit down. Okay. I can't believe you didn't tell us you were bitten. I didn't want to scare anyone. Because yep. you were scared yourself. I'd been bitten by a walker. You thought we'd turn on you. Sure. You were scared. I don't blame you. I would be scared shitless. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. I'm hoping whatever's in there bite is gone too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. You don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? We just get, uh... We figure out who he is, and why he's doing this. Yep. We can rescue Clem, but she won't be safe if this guy's not gonna stop. So, did your crew get into any shit before you met up with us? Is it possible to have survived and not gotten into some shit? And, you know, whatever happens to you, uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off! What good is it to plan around that work? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not doing this right now. Krista, listen to him. It's what I want, okay? What about him? Mm. We uh, gotta support him. He's only a kid still. It's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? No, that was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. <laughs> Kenny's been horrible to her. He blames Ben for his family's death, and it's just more complicated than that. Well, seems like it got through to Kenny. Whatever that's good for. All right. I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. Uh, that, uh, feeling any better? Uh... Still feels pretty recently chopped. So, no, Kenny feels about as, uh, good as you'd expect. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it, did it help at all? I feel like a man who got bitten. 
So take that for what it's worth. Heard you guys giving Lee some hell about hiding his bike. Yeah, of course. I'd have done the same thing. How are you? I'm... I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. Well, as much uh, as I can. We don't need to get emotional. I'm just asking him how he is. Lee's right. Your boyfriend's making decent progress. Need to be ready to move. I agree. I just wanted to say, you've all lost a lot. We're still here, though. Take it easy on him from here on out. Yes, I'm angry indeed. as hell. Not at him. Maybe. Maybe not. You heard him outside. I did. I never really thought about it that way. Really? This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Well, he can't fight for shit. Well, look at him. Hey, soft as rotten fruit. Like you guys didn't have enough problems without punching each other in the face? Yeah, he had to knock some sense into me before we met you on the train. Uh... It's all water under the bridge. All we can do is move forward. Well, cheers. <laughs> Um, yeah, I think I can use some. <laughs> I'm through. Nice. No walkers. Things are looking up. Everyone keep a goddamn eye out. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well. Oh. Them. Couple. <sighs> How could they do this? It's what Katya did. Jesus. I'm sorry, kid. She left me, a son, people that cared about us. I forgive her, but it don't make it any less wrong. You don't just end it, because it's hard. You stick it out, and you help the folks you care about. So let's figure a way out of here and get that little girl. Yes. We should move. Yeah. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed. 